understand why two high-level sides about to face each other and it's anyone's guess how this is going to end up. It's live on EA TV. Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Barcelona against Girona. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The seat. Oh, could be! And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And here's the Girona starting 11. David Lopez plays alongside Daly Blint in central defence and a formidable striker in this setup in the person of Christian Stuani. Valeri will be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Well, for Girona, you have to conclude everything went to plan in the win against Atletico. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Well, in a very tight game, they certainly deserve their victory. But today, it's a different proposition entirely. They're going to be up against it, and I can't see them getting anything from this game. Yangel Herrera. Garcia. And the emphasis is on creativity. Intercepting it intelligently. An example of how to press. Well, for Girona, you have to say it was a good performance and result in the last match against Atletico. How might this one go, Stuart? Well, Derek, they've looked great all season and deserve to be top. But this is when the pressure will be on them. If they can stay relaxed, play with the same energy and keep everybody fit, they're my favourites for the title. Chance to attack using width. Oh, that's a really good run. Stuani! Well, what a glorious chance to grab the first goal of the contest. Well, you have to say that's a wasted opportunity to get their noses in front here. Golden opportunity. Young Torres well you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow Stuart what do you think we'll see from him today well in many ways he's a throwback to the 80s in the way he plays he's so strong when holding up the play he can out muscle opponents today the defenders will certainly know they've been in a battle Pedri Kunde looking for someone to play it to determined defending About the short corner. Oh, body in the way, crucially. It's 
a short corner. Frankie de Jong. Here's Rafinha. Vital intervention. Herrera. Martin. Read it superbly to take back possession. Well, Barcelona have had most of the ball in the last 15 minutes and created a hat full of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession, you need to make it count. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. And very nicely positioned to win it back. He continues his run. Opportunity to go ahead. Oh, a goal! There it is! And the crowd stunned into silence. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And then through on goal, you never really had any doubt that he wouldn't slot that away. It's a cool finish. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Lewandowski. Pedri. Here's Rafinha. De Jong. And back to De Jong. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. The fans want to see a shot. He got a good palm on it. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Trying to open them up. And there it is, a chance. Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And the finish is so clinical. He just rolls it past the keeper, cool as you like. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? So, the ball rolling again at 2-0. Torres. Pedri. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. Oh, fancy footwork. I'll tell you what, that is really top-class defending. Garcia. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? It's there for him. There it is. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plomb. It's a great goal. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Marcos Alonso. And Torres on the ball. Pedri. And it's with Inigo Martinez. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Ferran Torres. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Valeri. Martin. Now veering in field. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Pedri. 
Lewandowski now. De Jong. And they need to get tighter here. Shown inside. It could be up for grabs. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, Robert Lewandowski hasn't quite influenced the game in the manner we thought he might, Stuart. Yeah, he's not had his usual impact, has he? He just hasn't got on the ball in dangerous positions. He's got to keep working hard to find that little bit of space to make something happen, that's for sure. Well, they get the ball rolling again. Barca's first half struggles were there for all to see. Can they make a better fist of it in this half? Could it keep the ball? An encouraging move from Barca. De Jong. Valeri. He's in here. A majestic piece of goalkeeping there. That's goalkeeping at its best. He's so hard to beat from that sort of range. Another La Liga treat in store for you soon on EA TV. It's Barcelona and they'll be taking on Cadiz. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. And the referee has given the advantage to Barca. Well, he was very keen to give them the advantage, but instead it will be a free kick now. He'll be a bit cross with himself based on that free kick. Not the execution he was looking for. Martinez. Viktor Tsigankov. Christian Stuani. And Barcelona have possession again. Torres. Trying to create something. Firing it in. Great defending. And unable to find the target. They put themselves under pressure and have to start finishing chances. Well, frustration amongst the players. That was half a chance to reduce the deficit there. Herrera. Ivan Martín. Excellent ball over the top. Just the challenge that was required. Ronald Araujo. On to De Jong. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more live La Liga action for you to look forward to. It's Girona against Alaves. And passing it well. And a fine cross. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say.
Christian Estuani. Working so hard to win back possession. Well, this could really help the cause. Stuani! Oh, a tremendous block. Pedri. And it's with Inigo Martinez. Went in strongly, decisively. Promising looking attack. Oh, big opportunity! Good piece of defending. Arnau Martinez. Oh, breezing past him. Stuani! Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Plentiful supply, 4-1 currently. Lewandowski. And there to intervene. Barcelona have been awarded the throw-in. Marcos Alonso. Now with De Jong. Rafinha. Delivered into the box. And a simple clearance, a good one. Lewandowski. And return to De Jong. Marcus Alonso. And a very good challenge. Torres. On to Alonso, looking for someone to play it to. Well, he knows what he's doing defensively. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Ten minutes to go. Good work to regain possession. Marcos Alonso. Inigo Martinez. Here's Rafinha. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Decent looking pass. Oh, gifting away possession. And just five minutes remaining. Yangel Herrera. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And crossing towards the far post. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Just couldn't get it through. The delivery. And clears the danger. Just had to look a bit lively given the pressure. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Well, he's given it away. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. A 
And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today. Well, they put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable, and he inspires those around him. 